Welcome back everyone, I'm the Depressed Eeyore and this is Enter the Gungeon. That's pretty much it. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and uh, go into this. The good news is the quest we're working on, the uh, the goal post gets moved closer to us rather than further away. Uh, we need to get to floor 3 to um, get the arm and get it up to floor 2. Alright, so, we'll, whoop, whoop, adjusting my headset when that was happening. I was not expecting explosives right in the first room, but this game hates me, so. Uh, I'll try not to loot any chest until I'm absolutely certain I can. It's either I can't get the, um, the, um, fireplace taken care of, or um, I can't get a second key. If I can't get a second key, I might as well use the one key I have. More than likely, I'll probably be able to get a second key, though, so we'll see. it's all going to depend on whether or not I can get a water barrel over to where I need to be. that one anyway, so... A bit late, but I just felt like recording something and I didn't really want to record another session of, uh, of Divinity Original Sin 2. That was a little close. It feels like the rooms have gotten harder and I'm not getting as good of luck for um, getting, getting uh, weapons. Like, I get like a few good weapons, but like, it's always all like the same, like, I guess, type of weapon. Like, I don't get very much variety, and certain bosses I simply just do better with certain weapons. Got my speakers a little bit. Alright. Water barrels right there, so oh, he just broke the water barrel. All right, well. It's quite possible I can't do it now. Um, depends if I can find another water barrel or not, which is pretty unlikely. They usually at least make sure there's at least one, but if it's broken, there's not much I can do about it. Just checking that room while I'm here. Which, I mean, I don't mind. It means I can use my keys now, but... There's always that slim possibility that there might be another one. I really feel like every time we beat the game, the, the, the overall difficulty of the game actually increases. wasn't much I can do about it. I was trying to avoid breaking it when I was fighting the, um, the bullet can, but when they spawned the book right next to it, I literally could not do anything about it. I would ha I would have had to like act immediately and kill it, which I didn't react really that well. So my my initial reaction was to avoid it. That way they would force the move, but books don't really move much. They just keep firing for no reason. There 
is a spare key. We will go ahead and grab the said spare key. I don't get why, like, we always get this bottle. I don't know what the bottle does. Maybe someday I'll actually buy it, but I'm pretty sure it's a usable item. Barely certain it's a usable item. Here, question. Sometimes the, pl the shop has uh, barrels. This one doesn't. Okay, boss room. So I have two keys, but uh, there's no sign of a, another, a second water barrel for me to use. So that's a problem. But yeah, it feels, like I said, the, uh, like I've seen a lot more of the bullet can with machine guns. I mean, usually I don't see those until much later. Is that everything? Really? I so. Oh, I can go left. Alright, chest. Let's, um, head on down here. Alright. Alright, so another treasure room that I won't be able to get past. Yep, that's it. So yeah, um, I'm gonna go ahead and loot that one green chest. If I get a second key, I'll, I'll go for the other green chest as well, but might as well go for the chest, it only requires one. Hit holster, quick draw. Fires a bullet upon reloading. Oh, she fires a free shot, I guess. Not too shabby. Uh, the twins. All right, I, I'm I'm ex I'm already expecting I'm gonna get hits. I'm definitely not on my A game today. Yep, there it goes. The bolts are spaced out in such a way that freaking rolling is usually more dangerous than anything. make this fight go faster, having another gun. One hit. That's alright. Only one credit too, which kind of sucks. Because everything's so expensive now. Laser rifle, blast off. A commonplace energy weapon. A laser rifle is the AK-47 of the future, known for its low manufacturing cost and low maintenance requirements. Laser rifle is used throughout the galaxy by hunters and miscreants alike. Burst. All right. Uh, 
yeah, I don't have another key, so that's pretty much it. Let's get going. So yeah, we're just going down the normal floors this time. Ah, that gremlin just takes everything now. He used to not always, he used to leave things there. Now it just grabs everything but health. Not much I can do about it either. Alright shop, what do you got? Try not to disappoint me too much. Molotov, smokes... I don't even know what the cigarettes do. Uh, we can get a key though. So you know what, let's uh... We'll wait. We'll grab a key after, just in case there's a challenge room. Amazing, I avoided that. Got a key. Also, I've noticed a lot of the earlier rooms now do uh, three waves instead of just capping out at two, usually. Maybe it's going all... Our, all our darker purpose and making it harder every time I play through the game. But heck, even that game doesn't really up the difficulty that much, it just ex extends the amount of levels you go through. Yeah, not dealing with you. Just what I was con I was concerned about. There is a challenge room. Clear a forthcoming room without dodge rolling. I'm sure, I can do that. Oh, it's not even it's not even next door. Oh, it is next door. Wow, that was it. Alright, the Raiden Coil. This is, this is actually a weapon we just unlocked. Damages all enemies on screen no matter what. This cannon was built for mounting, a, uh, mounting on supersonic attack fighters but has been retrofitted to be carried by infantry. An inscription on the barrel reads, Know thy own position, and all others inevitably fail. All enemies on screen, no matter what. Alright, I'm curious. You have my attention. Took a hit for no reason, but it is definitely interesting. But it wasn't really a good test. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, 
does exactly what it says. So this is good for clearing out big rooms. So, got the ruby bracelet, which is not useful because I don't throw guns. Uh, we did get a shield back, which is just going to mock me because I'm going to lose it. And I'm not going to get the three shields anyway. Especially when I screw up like that. We got, we got up here. So it hits everything on the screen, so big rooms is actually slightly an issue. Alright, that should be a treasure room. It certainly is. Hot lead, chance to ignite. All bullets have a chance to ignite foes. Freshly formed shells straight from the Gungeon's Forge. The metal slug at the center of each round is still molten. Alright, interesting. Let's, uh... Yeah, all we got left is boss round, so let's do it. Alright, been a while since I fought you, but we'll see if we can do this. Oh, freaking thing spawned right. Well. So the beat, that freaking minion spawned right above me. Usually they spawn near the enemy. So it shoots a red bullet to show that's going to ignite. Dragoon fire roar. Interesting. Alright. Um, let's grab some health. This rifle doesn't seem to do very good damage, unfortunately. So it is what it is. Uh, I will buy... I'm not gonna- that should hold me over. Uh, let's look up what the dragon fire does. 
Finally, balanced rapid fire can ignite foes. Oh, okay, so that's redundant. That's okay. We at least have some. At least we have some decent fodder guns that we can use in combat. Not good for bosses, but well, draw gunfire might be all right. All right, so we got the raiding coil. Let's get that going. We got one shield. I'm not. It's not going to happen. I'm saying it right now, but I have one shield. I mean, all it's for is shortcuts, but you know, completion has and all that. Alright, 4-3, so we should need to look for an arm and a balloon. A little hard to see. Pay attention. I'm trying to like stay, keep everything on the screen so I can hit it all at once, which is a necessary distraction. Offering, the rest is blank. We'll just keep going. We'll use this gun for now. Alright, that thing. The bigger bullet one.
Alright, found the balloon. Now I need to find the arm. Arm sent to pre previous chamber. So now it's on floor two. Boss room. I have a lot of freaking casings. Should have probably bought that other key. But something tells me I'm not going to get anything in the shops. I was correct. Well, there's ammo. Oh, and this. Let's get rid of the jolter. Well, let's get definitely get rid of the laser rifle. It's served its purpose. And we'll work with the rest for now. I do have my usable ammo drop, so if I I can refill most of my guns at this point. Go all the way across. I'm not reloading as much since it gives me a free shot now. Alright, I believe that's immunity to fire and poison. Fire, poison, and electricity. I've never seen electricity. So that's everything. That's the that's the whole thing. Alright, I'm gonna use the jolter. I'll buy some keys. I'll be back for the rest of that stuff later. Actually, I'll use the drag gun. See what happens. This'll be a pain. Not even remotely clean, but but 
Bakarov. Keep the people's gun. I don't know how to pronounce that. Uh, it was brought to the Gunja by Lost Cosmonaut. Uh, some say that Brave Lost Soul still wanders the Gunja. This gun is no better or worse than any other gun. Good to know. Yeah, it's no better than any other gun. Alright, well with that, let's uh, drop off that. We'll hold on to the... We'll use the jolter. Yeah, we'll use the jolter. And so I'll recharge the Raiden coil. I bought everything in the store except for this item. I'm not going to buy that item. For obvious reasons. Alright, any hearts? Nope. Alright, let's get going. <laughs> 